It's cut OC whatever here, what? what? Alice Ill, at underscore Alice Ill. Make sure y'all follow me, motherfucker. I just dropped my motherfucking tape, so get ready for that shit. Alice Ill, how you get in there? I got my name on the south side. <clears throat> okay. Basically, I was chilling out there. They was like, you need a name, my nigga. So they started calling me Ellis, and I fucked with the shit because I like Perry Ellis, you feel me? Okay. So then I went back and I kind of reconstructed my rap name, and I add the L on it because I'm Ellis shit. No question. Ellis Ill. How long, boy, Ellis Ill. How long have you been rapping? I've been rapping since I was like, shit. I've been rapping since I was like 15, 14, 13, shit so like that. So how long you been an artist? I've been an artist since probably like, I've been recording since 18, but I've been promoting myself since last year. Okay. Like really promoting myself. I've been on SoundCloud forever, but I wasn't really promoting that shit, you know what I mean? Okay. Who you rocking with producer-wise? Producer-wise, I don't really have no huge names on my shit right now. I'm okay. trying to launch out, but. You know what I'm saying? I don't jack no beats. I don't jack no beats. Okay, you're playing you know what I'm saying? Everything. I go on Arabic, I go on different sites, I purchase them, lease them, get the whole contract, you know, depending on how the budget is or what the beat's going on or what I can do with it. Right now, I am working with a couple of people that are unknown, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm trying to start something. And he's lying right now, because he definitely got Dolan. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So you can't be too humble if he's lying. Let me let y'all know he's lying. You got Dolan. I got Dolan. I got Dolan. Dolan is one of the, you know what I'm saying, super producers in our area. That yeah. I would say, like, he is super producer. Yeah. It's, a lot, it's a lot of super producers here, though. So we want to work with Spock Yeah, I'm trying to work with Spock So, yeah, if you see this, Spock Him, for real. So, yeah, so you got, you know what I'm saying, who else you want to work with? We got a lot of good producers in the area, too. I'm trying to work with Spitz. Special. Yeah, shout out to YB. That nigga, uh, yeah, YB if y'all like hear that song, I Know on my jump, he produced that joint. He mixed it, he mixed it and everything. You know, I got the beat from someone else, but he put his magic touch on that joint, for real. No question. You no, know, free YB, free YB. So with the hour we got, all right, what, 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 we, what we got? Uh, this joint called Playmakers. Playmakers, it's, it's an album, right? It's a mixtape. Mixtape. It just, it's put on, you know, iTunes called it an album, but I call it a mixtape. Okay, Playmakers. Mm -hmm. why, why you come up with that title? Shit, that's the story of my life. Okay. I'm making plays all day, every day. Okay. That's how I eat. That's how you eat? Mm-hmm. No question, how many songs? How many songs? Nine. Okay. Any features? Any features? I got got featured by my man Big Kai and Famous Tay. Where they from? They from uh, Famous, I mean, uh, Big Kai from Trinidad. Okay. Famous Tay, I ain't really asked him where he from, but uh, he was I cool. can follow him. He was cool. Yeah, he was cool, he was cool. <laughs> I met him through Big Kai, you okay. feel me? So like, that was that was Big Kai man. He was like, look, you gotta fuck my man Famous Tay, he vicious, you know what I'm saying? Gonna write the hook, I got a verse for you, you know what I'm saying? Let's do it, you know what I'm saying? Was cool? Yeah, they was cool, they cool, I'll let them. Uh, I got, uh, they got They got this new joint out called Skirt Skirt on YouTube right now, that joint, that joint popping, I'm telling no you. No question. So if, if, if we had a label deal right now, mm -hmm. if I gave you a label deal, who would you sign right now? Because I always ask people who their favorite artist, and then they, it goes to the left and they say all they been. So now I'm going to ask you, if you, on the other hand, wasn't a rapper and you was a label, who in the DMV would you sign to your label? Five people. Who in the DMV? Yeah. Would I sign to? Yeah. No, who would you sign? Who would you sign? What artist in the DMV would you sign to you if you was a label? Oh, a okay. In the DMV. Let me see where you're at. All right. I'm gonna name, you want me to name people, everybody now? Cause I, I got some, you know what I'm saying? No. I'm an independent artist, so I be working with, no, I know people. Say people that you, you will work, cause I know it's gonna be one star on your list, you gotta have a star on your yeah, list. Yeah, I know, I know, I don't wanna So like, you're five, you're five. Alright, to start with a star from the DMV, I say, I go with Big Meecha. Salute to my brother. Yeah, yeah, I work with Big Meecha, I, I'm feeling this shit right now, you know what I'm no saying? No question. But, and then, I, I go with my man, Liv Yada. Okay. Y'all gotta check out my man Liv Yada out, out of the College Park area. Actually, we got some songs, but you know what I'm saying? Some underground shit, we ain't put it out, you know what I'm saying? Just some linking up off some work type shit. Um, I go with... Oh, I definitely go with Bino. I go with Bino. Yeah, my number three. Free Bino. Yeah, definitely Free Bino, you know what I'm saying? Uh, number four, I say to go down underground again, I say uh, JB the Villain. You know what I'm saying, my man, out of green belt. I do the dash, I be sliding out green belt. Little bitch better fasten your seatbelt. Y'all gotta fuck with my man, for real. And uh, last but not least, hmm, out the DMV, 
I think I'll do a feature with Cuta Fool. He said a feature. Look, we said who would you say? Oh, my fault, my fault. Look, we talked yeah, about this lady. Fine. This nigga talking about he trying to do a feature. <laughs> he I, went right back in artist mode. That's what I like. All right, cute fool. I put, I put him on my label too, but you know yeah, what I Look, well, too. first, this ain't he an independent artist. He got three stars on this list. <laughs> Only two people on the ground. Oh, yeah. you want me to shout out the people that are on ground? All right, fuck. We're going to slide off cute fool. We're going to slide off Bino. And you know, cause they stars. All right, I'm gonna shout out my man Kazo Escobar. Okay. Uh huh. Yeah, that's another person I get a feature with, and um, I get a feature with my man. We're not doing features. We we signed it. I mean, yeah, sign it, sign it. Look, excuse me, y'all see, I'm trying to. It's Saturday, man. Look, I'm chilling. <laughs> All right. All right. Last but not least, I give it to my man. Hmm. Only one Cartier. Okay. Only one Cartier. Okay, what, what would you call your style of music? My style of music, I like to call it like trap drip. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you want to add a new style okay. flip to it, but like, yeah. Yeah, I, I see you doing a lot of moves. I hear the, the melodic tempos. Yeah, exactly, exactly. I follow, I listen, exactly. I, I'm, exactly. I'm into, I'm into. You know so where you, come, where, where you from? Well, I'm from Silver Spring, Maryland. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's where I'm from. That's where I went to school. I went to school at Blair. Okay. Blair High School, you know what I'm saying? I hung out with the Migos. I was gang banging. You was gang banging you know with the Migos? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Niggas thought I was Spanish for a real long you time. You didn't expect you to go for Puerto Rican. Niggas thought I was Dominican. Or Dominican. Yeah, I was yeah, about to say that. Yeah, all that shit. So I ain't even lying to y'all motherfuckers, son. Y'all go back and ask any of my old friends. Niggas was throwing them hands with the Migos. Blair well, had shit. the bitches back in the day, too. Shh. <laughs> My uncle lived on Midway Ave all my life, so I knew like all the Blair bitches was bad. Like they were top of the line. Crazy. Yeah, we had a couple of schools though that we would hop to. We hopped to uh, we hopped to motherfucking Northwood, and we hopped to Einstein. Einstein had some Spanish joints, but they had the MS bitches. We didn't fuck with the MS bitches. We didn't <laughs> fuck with MS niggas at all. Fuck all that shit. That was like our main beef back in the day. But, like, Nah, cause one of them smoked my mans way oh, yeah, back that's when we did. Yeah, rest in peace to Thailand. Rest in peace Thailand, real shit. Real shit on the 16 bus. Damn, yeah. that's crazy. So how, how how far do you want to go with this music shit? Shit, as far as it want to take me. I'm going to keep on pushing, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to feed my family. No question. I'm trying to turn negatives into positives. No question. All right, 2018 summer is almost over. What do we have in store? Shit. I'm trying to put together another tape. Okay. On this tape coming hosted up. Hosted by me. Hmm? Hosted by me. Shit, I'm down with it. I host big yeah. You gotta hit me. I'm crazy. I'm DJ Driver. DJ. Yeah, you was on my man Lil Tootie Jump. Yeah, you heard me. I'm yeah, crazy. Yeah, yeah, on the road. That's my shit. I've been on the road. Shout out Lil Tootie. I, I put him on my label too. Lil Tootie, yeah. Definitely on my list. Definitely on my list. So you do I host the big Yeah. Yeah, look, I just put my joint up. Right. Just put it up. And that's where I'm going at. My next tape, I'm trying to like. I'm trying to get it to where every track I personally work on somebody. You know what I'm saying? Somebody. Oh, you talking about like executive producer? Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like I got somebody that I know. Nigga, come out here. He makes some vicious ass beats. He ain't got no like handle or nothing. That's why I can't shout the nigga out or nothing. I ain't gonna put his government name up. You know, Ooh. shout out B. But like, <laughs> but real shit though, like the nigga makes beats, right? And the nigga been throwing me these beats for like a year now. Like, yeah, check this out, check this out, check this out. And like, finally, he, he like, man, I know your flow now. I got a beat for you. That nigga got a beat for me. So like, boom, that's one. I got the nigga that records me out at uh, Blueprint Studios. Full Smooth, shout out Full Smooth. That nigga, I put him on my label. That nigga be my beat maker and he'll be artist. But like, he very talented. But uh, yeah, I'm trying to work with him directly, as far as beats too. And um, Dolan. Dolan, yeah, I'm trying to shout back out at Dolan. I told Dolan that I'm gonna try to holler at him when I go out to Atlanta. But you know, this nigga be on moves because that song he got with uh, Bino, Ten Band Bricks. You know that joint cranking, so that shit taking him to another level right now, like for real. So like that nigga gonna be hard to catch. I should have caught that nigga like <laughs> when I first hollered at that nigga. I just DM'd that. Yeah, if y'all check out Trap Rock. Um, y'all check out, what is it, Line, and if y'all check out, what's the other jump? See, I'm fried, I can't even remember the song, I'm about to show y'all the jump. But like, I don't even know who the fuck that is, who is that? Cause you know, I thought that was shit was Chief Keef, I ain't gonna lie. Cause you know how you start calling yourself Chief Turbo? Yeah, it's a nigga 
that work with he a young nigga. He worked with Gunner, Dave East. He the gave beast that Brian went to his page the other day. I said, yo, that young nigga is working. His place was it's crazy. They it, it said, turn it back, turn it yeah, 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 I know you're talking about. I know exactly oh, what you're talking about. It's crazy. I, I really got into production lately. Like, I really like, I've stopped following artists. I follow producers. Stop. Because that's where the sound is coming. The engineer, which really makes the sound mm -hmm. unique. But the producer is the reason why the music cranks so hard. Exactly. It's like, you gotta think How about you it. How you think about it. How like, you that pay the producers? That's what I'm saying. How do they get signed like that? And that's why they try and go up on a beat like son. You think about it like made in Tyre, like one of the reasons he cranks is cause his beats. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Uh Playboy Cardi, another reason Big he cranks his beats that dumb. He'd be like, oh shit. Big Crick Crick cause his beats and he make his own beats. Oh, he made his beats off a of PlayStation. It's crazy. That's what I'm saying. Grind be so it'd be so amazing to see that niggas really be grinding. Mm -hmm. Like you out here grinding. We got another interview we gonna do. About something totally different from music. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm saying. Like you grind it, you you get yourself in a in a position where you can go crazy. Mm -hmm. I'm trying. Look, I'm trying to put myself on. But real quick, the songs that Dolan did on my joint is uh, number two trap rock, uh, number six DMV drip, and number five line. So check that shit out. LSL Playmaker, iTunes, Spotify, um, Title, YouTube. Well, check I mean, me on SoundCloud, check me on Spiral, all that shit, for real. This yeah. next tape will be hosted by me, we ain't got no name yet. We ain't got no name. We ain't so, got no name yet, but it's definitely. How you feel about the DMV? I know. How you feel about the DMV, and how you feel about the radio? How I feel about the DMV, I feel like it's improving, definitely. Okay. We Atlanta, like we the next Atlanta, definitely. But the beef shit gotta stop a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Like. I feel like if the beef shit cut down a little bit, it'll be a little bit better. If we could all get along a little bit better, you know what I'm saying? Because I feel like I'm down with any of that shit, you feel me? Like, I feel like we all try and get the fuck out of here, take care of our mothers, daughters, sons, cousins, uncles, aunties, ourselves, all that shit. So, like, why not just put it all together, put our minds together and figure out how to get the fuck about this joint or turn this joint into Black Hollywood, you hear me? No question. The radio, how you feel about it? I don't listen to that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like it's going down anyway. When I'm driving, that's what I'm doing, you know what I'm saying? When I'm making my plays, I'm on my phone all day. Of course. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like the internet radio is definitely coming up. Of course. You know what I'm saying? When I do listen to it, I like to listen to like some peaceful ass shit. So I don't even be on that 95.5, 93.9. What's your biggest motivation with music? My family. Okay. Uh, I really want like I really I'm trying to take everybody to a different place. I want everybody to see what I ain't even see yet. You feel me? And I know like if I can get to that level, you know what I'm saying? Like that offset, you know what I'm saying? That cue the fool, you know what I'm saying? Wale, all these big levels. I'm gonna buy a community. Fuck all that shit. I'm gonna be on some Rallo type shit. You know what I'm saying? Like free Rallo, free Rallo for real. That's some like Rallo inspirational nigga. Like Fox shit, Fox real, shit. Yeah. Uh. Summer is going crazy. Mm -hmm. You got your, you got your, I say it's an album. You got your album right now. You going crazy. You trying to put Silver Spring on. It, it's kind of hard. Like, I'm trying to put I, the whole DMV on. No, but I'm saying with you from your section, it's kind of hard. Like, see, like, let me tell you about the DMV a little, a little quick because a lot of people don't like it when I be talking this real shit. The DMV is built on like DC, Maryland, Virginia. Yeah. Virginia always get exit out on a while, so but I made a lot of money in Virginia. I love Virginia. I salute to all the people that's from Virginia. Yeah, my girl from Virginia. Maryland. Maryland is Landover, you know what I'm saying? Forest Creek, Capitol Heights, District Heights, Silver Spring, Ward mm -hmm. off. It's, it's a lot of parts of uh, Maryland that's far. DC is one big circle. So that's why everybody, you see everybody support each other, everybody know each other, because it's so small. It's really the District of Columbia. It's only smaller shit. Yeah, Maryland is Columbia. a little bit big. It go all the way down to the eastern shore. You got Calvert County. You got Calvert Calvary County, County, Howard County. All these counties in this one place. But Silver Spring is like an area where not a lot of people really travel to if they want to hear music. Music wasn't big in Silver Spring. Salute to my boy Global Dad. 
He one of the people that's Oh funny. yeah, shout out to Global Dan and my nigga uh Bob. Shout out to this song right here, Life, cause it got a star, you feel me? And this ain't banging right here, this shit talk about my whole life. I wanna give a shout out to my niggas in Silver Spring, you feel me? I wanna give a shout out to my niggas in Uptown, I wanna give a shout out to my niggas out Southside, Woodland, all that shit, son. The niggas had my back, you know what I'm saying? The niggas showed me love since day one, you feel me? All that shit. Shout out to everybody, you know what I'm saying, that support my music. Shout out to the studios recording me. Shout out to my nigga for Smooth, for, you know what I'm saying? I fuck with that nigga, that's the nigga I'm be working with. Shout out to Cutthroat right here for showing me love and being, you know, able to meet up with a nigga. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to this pack, cause this shit is good as hell. You know what I'm saying? Shout out, shout out to my girl, shout out to life, shout out to love, shout out to all that shit, yeah. Shout out to playmakers, cause we making plays, my nigga. No question. It's Cutthroat TV. Got my boy Wise behind the motherfucking lens. It's been great to chill, you know what I'm saying? To get high on contact. Cause you know, that's what we do at Cutthroat TV. Street hottest blogger in the hood, block. Y'all already know what it is.